Now I've debated that my sobriety is so forbated And I want to feel intoxicated For just a moment to escape it I miss you, I'm feeling weighted And it's been so long since I've been faded I'm not trying to make this complicated I'm proud of the life that I've created I you I miss when my eyes would dilate And I would start to get that taste that I waited all day for Settle that score with my head on my floor Painted my face with the lation till I forget Hey everybody, Card Bandit here today. What I'm gonna be doing today is sort of an updated tutorial on a move of mine called Twister. Um, the reason I'm making this updated tutorial is because I didn't like how I taught the, the move, having gone back and seen how I taught it. Um, I think that this is going to be a much better tutorial for teaching the move. And I want to sort of get into, the, get into making some better content, better tutorials. And so you'll probably see me post a couple, bunch, a couple updated tutorials along with new content as uh, time goes on, just so that I'm giving content that is higher quality than what I initially put on my channel for my like first initial videos. Um, but I still want those resources to be there for people learning cardistry. So uh, yeah, that's pretty much the reason I'm making this updated tutorial. Um, I hope you guys like the tutorial. If you haven't seen the move, I hope you enjoy the move. I used to really just like doing the twisting motion of the move until I got into the display, and I end up liking the I ended up liking the uh, display a little bit more than just the straight twisting move. But that's completely up to you. You can uh, do whatever you want, see what you like, even make variations, and I hope you enjoy it. Let's get into it. So starting with the opener, the first thing you're going to do is get into sort of a modified mechanic script. With your thumb actually on the top corner, you're then going to bring your pinky finger down to the bottom corner and peel off a packet of about five cards-ish. That packet's going to get extended from the deck and then your ring finger is going to contact the long edge and rotate that packet around 360 degrees. Curling in your ring finger and then pushing through so that packet goes over top of your hand. From here you're going to take your thumb and your ring finger and you're going to grab another packet from the opposite corners of the deck, a packet of about five cards or so. From here you're going to move your hand up and rotate that packet around using your middle finger, rotating it around, pushing through so it's rotated 360 degrees. You're going to peel off a card now with your index finger, gripping it between the index finger and the middle finger and extending it out, and that's your opener. Getting into the midsection of the cut, the first thing you're going to be doing is rotating your deck hand up to grab that single card between the index finger and the middle finger of the deck hand. Keep in mind the deck will primarily be gripped between the palm of the hand, the pinky finger, and the ring finger. The ring finger now, however, comes and contacts that middle packet that's held between the pinky and the thumb. So the ring finger is going to contact it on the corner, gripping it, and then from here you're going to be removing your pinky finger and transferring that packet over to the palm. So that packet's now held between the palm and the thumb. You're now going to be doing sort of two separate motions and I want to get into them individually and then you'll combine them when you do the cut. The first of those motions is rotating that top packet around 360 degrees, sort of spidering your fingers. So your middle finger comes along the short edge, rotates it halfway, and then your index finger comes along the long edge and rotates it. So middle finger, short edge, rotating it around, index finger, and you're going to be spinning that around consistently to keep the motion up. The next motion is you're going to be bringing your deck hand over top of your overhead hand and bending in the card using your index finger and your middle finger. So sort of rotating that packet over using that middle packet as the fulcrum. So combined, slowly it should look something like this where you've got one packet spinning, the other one coming over top, and then up to speed, it should look something like this. And that is gonna be the midsection of your cut. 
Once you finish those motions as much as you want, we're going to get into the closer. The first thing being which you're going to take that single card, bend in your index finger and middle finger and place that card on top of that mid packet that's held between the thumb and the palm. You're going to line it up and that packet actually comes in on top of the middle, sorry, the ring finger here. So that mid packet's held between the middle finger, the ring finger and the palm of the overhead hand and you re can release your thumb. At the same time, you can simultaneously rotate that card in the overhead hand as you're doing it, that motion just to keep the motion of the cut fluid. From here, you're going to rotate your palm up or push your palm up and rotate that middle packet over top of your middle finger. You're going to bring in your ring finger, closing that packet on top, pulling out your middle finger and getting into mechanics grip again. From here you can close the packet however you want, you can use some embellishment or just place the packet on top. And that's the twister cut and we're going to get into how to do the display from here. Alright so let's do the twister display now. The first thing you're going to be doing is just the regular twister cut so you should have that down before you try and do this display. Grab that one packet, rotate it around, grab another packet, rotate that around peeling it off with the index finger and the middle finger, reaching around with the deck hand, transferring that single packet, transferring that middle packet into the palm, doing those uh, two simultaneous motions that we talked about earlier. And you should have followed along up to this point, and this is where things get different. You're gonna peel off another card with the index finger and the middle finger in the overhead hand. You're going to bring your pinky finger down to the packet that's held between the thumb and the palm and the pinky finger is going to peel off another packet. From here you can spread your hands out rotating the thumb backwards along the palm so that way you get more of a, of a display going and you can display the cards from here. So you get into a really neat funky uh, six packet display. To close the display up you bring your thumb on top of that middle packet and you're going to rotate your hand over to bring that packet on top of the deck. In the left hand, you're sort of going to do a bullet sort of closer, bringing that single card on top with the middle finger and then dragging it underneath the deck with the, th uh, with the thumb. Your overhead hand turns that single card on top of the deck. You can then rotate that other packet around and then bring it in on top of the deck, sort of twisting it. However you would like to close that last packet, it's up to you. And then that is your twister display. Let's get into some slow-mo shots and then the outro.
right, so you made it to the end of the video. Congratulations. Um, or you just skip to the end of the video. Either one, that's, uh, that's fine. <laughs> I still want to thank you for your interest in the move and the interest in learning it. Um, yeah, I know, like I said, it's an updated tutorial, but, so I hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, thank you so much. I look forward to bringing you guys some new content soon, and I will catch you in the next. God bless.